Constantino, where did you study art, or are you self-taught? Part is self-taught, and part is uh, I was trained as a tool maker okay. in Peru. And, uh, okay. That skills helps me to to reduce materials and perhaps uh, giving not new shape by using my skills. Mm -hmm. And how long have you been an artist? That's a hard question to ask. <laughs> okay. Because, I mean, I've been probably an artist all my life, oh. but I, with, because I have something that was left from my mother. My mm -hmm. mother always see in the sky figures, and she said. Uh, oh, can you see this creature there? And I said, no, mom, you're crazy. But now I am seeing that way, you know. I, I find a figures and pieces that I didn't see before, like a piece of cup that I twisted and suddenly become a shape mm -hmm. that will speak to me in such a way by giving a little story. And then I can continue with that. Uh, as far as your art goes, does each of your pieces have an independent story, or there's some of them that are related to each other? I try to keep it re related to each other. Okay. I try, and I, and most of my pieces they they interact together, and they have a slight movement. Okay. Okay. I don't use, uh, I don't weld much. I try to use screws, rivets, and springs, mm -hmm. so they can move. Ah. And can be touched too. Okay. And for people who are still making their way to automatic, what is your space number? My space number is 3502. All right. So for anybody who didn't hear that, that's 3502. Yes. Mm -hmm. And for out of towners who won't be able to make it, where can they find your art? Oh, one of the ways the social media uh, Instagram. Okay. Tiempo de Tango. Okay. And the website to Tiempo de Tango. All right. At net. All right. Constantino, thank you for taking the time out today. Thank you, Erica. Appreciate it.